All right. Maybe something in this mirror. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I don't like this. I don't like this. Is anyone in this room behind me right here? Oh my god! That was a knock clear as day. I swear to god, I saw this woman standing on like the second step. Just like looking at me. Are you sitting on this chair right here? Oh, shit. Higher. Higher. Bro, it literally felt like something just like breathed on my neck. Wow. That's big. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the vlog channel. Tonight, today, technically still, but also tonight, I'm going to be staying inside of this massive museum castle looking thing. I am pumped guys. I am pumped because I actually have never heard anything about this place until today. Angelo sent me the location. You can actually see him right there in the window. He's doing something. Probably up to no good, I'll be honest. But um, I actually just learned a little bit about this place and like the history of this place. And man, is it crazy. So first and foremost, the people that resided here at one point in time were very, very rich, very successful people, right? They actually had the patent for like weaved doors. It's crazy. It's, a, <laughs> it's actually crazy. But there is a basement and inside of the basement, there is rumored to be a coffin. And now the area around where the coffin is supposedly very, very haunted, obviously because the people who last resided here passed away on the property. And also up top right there, where you see the chair against the window, is also supposedly very very haunted so I, i'm excited man i'm excited i haven't done a haunted video in a while but man it's gonna be a blast tonight i have brother frank tv and angela with me so like i said we have the entire night here for ourselves we're completely alone we're gonna be investigating the place it's gonna be awesome but we are in Cortland, new york which is a very very hot spot for uh college kids and um it's also saturday night so like everyone's going out and then to top things off the place right next door <laughs> is having a wedding outside i mean you could probably see the gazebos in the back right there what are the odds so i don't know how well things are going to be like filmed inside of the building if i'm not able to like actually make like a full on haunted video for the main channel i'll probably just put together a video for the vlog channel as well as I can, and then we'll go from there. Let's go ahead and take a little a lap around the place. Let me go introduce my boys, and uh, yeah. So I wonder if we could go in there. That building looks sick. This looks like something out of, uh, I don't even know, the Wizards of Waverly Place. <laughs> Man, this is so cool. This is, I haven't done a haunted video in so long, so please, I just spit everywhere. Ew. Um, <laughs> please bear with me if, you know, I'm just, I get scared very easily and stuff like that. But, uh, man, this is, this is awesome. Let me uh, just show you guys a little bit around the place. And, uh, yeah, that's the wedding over there. Congratulations. I wish you the best. And, um, yeah, so sick. Alrighty. Well, I'm going to go head on inside and uh see what's popping in here all right here it's good shouldn't wow just take a look at this place this is incredible wow I need something like this in my house. <laughs> this is amazing. Ah. Oh. Oh, hi. How, hey. how you doing? I'm good. How are you, Angel? Look who it is. It's, it's me. Finally, he's sponsored by YouTube. <laughs> oh, guys. Or, or maybe that's just the team. 
Oh, it's just a team. <laughs> Dang. I am sponsored by Olight, though. And oh, I just got cool. this new Baton 3. Ooh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, I'm so sorry. To all of us. <laughs> I'm <Man>. so sorry. <laughs> well, welcome to the 1890 Mansion. Dude, this it place is, is incredible. incredible. So you are now in my haunted house. Okay. No, I'm just joking. Oh, okay. I wish, though. That'd be sick. Well, is this the basement? I guess. It looks like a basement. Go be a basement dweller. Okay. Oh, just, oh my god, okay. Well, that was a change. <laughs> that, no, no, <laughs> I'll say, I'll save the surprise for you. Okay, now this is incredible. Horsey. <laughs> I was gonna say something, but I'm gonna keep my comments to myself. <laughs> Howdy, guys. Um, be cool. Look at like all the old perfume bottles and how is that? Gotta be sugar, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, let's take a look over here. Oh, look at that bed. Oh my God. Oh my God. My heart right, right now. Man, I thought that was someone standing there. I thought it was you, partner. Wow, look at these notes. These are very old. So, um, fun fact, guys. You stay right there. <laughs> uh, fun fact, guys. Uh, Ghost Adventures actually came out here. And they filmed here a while back. And they had the most experience upstairs in the third floor. It's called the billiards room. So that's what we're gonna go check out. Just kinda wanna get a little tour of the place. Oh, just ghost equipment. This scares me. Oh, look at the doggy. All right, here we go. Here with Brother Frank. What's the one on it? Go ahead. Okay. You open up there, bro. Just in case there's anything loose. Oh, ho, ho. now this is a basement. Yeah, you ain't kidding, bro. And uh, there's a little part, but hook a left here. Hook a left? Yeah, yeah, go straight in. Be careful what you run into. Oh. Oh. Yeah, be <laughs> careful. Oh, my God. Be very careful, bro. I got to leave you alone down here. That thing creeps me out. When you're down here by yourself and you, you start, you know, engaging with your equipment. You know what? I think I'm going to. Yeah. Usually uh, I just, you know, it's covered. Somebody opened this. I don't know why this. I've never seen it open anytime I've come here. I've been here twice. It's been covered. So why that's opened, I don't know. Oh, my wow, God. Look at that mirror over there. Look at that mirror. Look what it says. Hi. How creepy is that? Very. All right, brother. I got to head upstairs. All right, man. We'll Thank catch you. up later. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'm going to fire up the spirit box right oh, now. Yeah, I wouldn't let you down with this one. No, no, you were right, man. Oh, okay. <coughs> All right. Um, I'm going to be honest, guys. Extension here. Wild. No idea if that's real or not. But I'm getting a little lightheaded. All right, I'm going to fire up my microphonic right now. Hold on. Okay. Brother Frank and Angela said that they were going to go outside. There's footsteps. All right, hold on. Let's try this again. Spirits of the basement of the property. My name is Yasko. I would like to communicate with you. If you can in any way, shape, or form communicate with me, I'd very much appreciate it. If you'd like to make a sound like this, for example, or on any of the materials in the room, uh, the mirror, the metal on the wall, some of the lockers in this room, thank you. Thank you. Um, let's get to know each other a little bit. 
High spirits. <laughs> Go home. <laughs> I'm nice. I'm, I'm a nice guy. I'd like to get to know you a little bit. What's your name? Three. Can you say that a little bit more clear? What's your name? That literally just said, don't turn around. <coughs> What's behind me? Why shouldn't I turn around? <coughs> I'm gonna turn around. <coughs> Is there somebody behind me? <coughs> How many spirits are down here with me? There's a jazz. Our Bro, what is going on right now? This is crazy. Okay. Um. Well, you know my name. I'd like to get to know your name. You told me not to turn around at one point. Are you trying to warn me of somebody? Who are you trying to warn me of? Well, the door just opened. The door just... Who is that? Who just opened that door? I heard Charles. Charles. Yes. What does Charles want with me? Who is inside of this casket? <laughs> Who's down here with me? Mike. Okay, hold on. Is Mike a bad spirit or a good spirit? What does that mean? Is Mike a bad spirit or a good spirit? Evil. Does, does Mike want to hurt me? Yes. But why does Mike want to hurt me? Were you killed, Mike? Or did Mike kill you? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay. I'm getting I'm getting your signs. I'm getting your signs. Okay, who's there? Who's there right now? Oh man, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. How about we continue? I'm gonna continue 
while walking through this. All right. Mike, are you down here with me right now? Are you in this room? Yes. Are you sitting on this chair right here? Higher. Bro, it literally felt like something just like breathed on my neck. Was that you, Mike, that just breathed on my neck? What do you want with me, Mike? Something coming from that room right there. Is anyone in that bathroom right there? Yes. Do you want me to come in the bathroom? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm coming into the bathroom. Do you do you want to hurt me in the bathroom? Ick. Sounds like they want to hurt me in the bathroom. Alrighty. I'm going to keep this on. I'm going to ask one last time. Do you want me to come into the bathroom? Alright. I'm going to come into the bathroom. Oh my god. Goodness gracious. It's like someone screamed upstairs. Alright. Maybe something in this mirror. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I don't like this. I don't like this. Who was that? What was that? Mike, was that you? He's evil. What does Mike want? Mike. Please leave me alone. Thank you, Mike. I'm gonna go back upstairs now, okay? crazy activity some crazy sounds tapping on that metal stuff over there we're hearing crazy things there's some type of mic here i'm actually gonna go ask brother frank if there was any sort of uh, mic in the history of this place um that door definitely moved my hands on the camera and my phone and um and these doors are old you know they, they take some movement oh my god Yeah, no, it definitely wasn't anybody. And there's also a brick right there, so good luck. Oh my gosh. All right, guys, so currently outside, and it is borderline impossible to do anything out here. It is a loud, loud place. Oh my God. I mean, like, if you look across the street, tons of people walking, tons of cars driving by, it is nuts. But uh, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and try to give you guys a good paranormal video. Uh, stuff in the basement was insane. Kept getting some sort of Michael. Mike, Michael. And it didn't sound too happy either. And I talked to Brother Frank. He was doing a spear box session himself. And he said that he was getting some pretty aggressive spirits on his end as well. 
So I don't know what's going on. Um, but yeah, with that being said, I'm gonna go meet up with Angelo in a bit. We're gonna go hit up the third floor, do like a spear box REM pod session up there and see how that goes. So I'll let you guys know, I'll see you guys there. Uh, cool transition incoming, you ready? Well, guys, um, we we're about to do a little session here. Uh, we were going to do it upstairs, but supposedly this is the most, from what the guide said, this is the most. It's the most uh, commonly, I don't know, active area, I guess you could say. So if I get possessed, Angelo, and I grab this baseball bat and just start pounding you with the baseball bat. Wait, show me how that would work. What do you mean, show you how it would work? I just hit your legs. Uh, no! There's <laughs> not, not much to it. Just... You with your big bat. <laughs> okay, and uh, back to the paranormal investigation. I just realized um, what you said. Yeah, so Frank was in here earlier. He got a whole bunch of stuff, like, to the point where... Yeah, I walked in on him and it broke. The REM pod was going off? Yeah. You know what he, he was like? If there's a kid in here, make this REM pod go green. And then it just went green. And I, I was like, what the hell? I've never seen that command do that. What'd you hear? What'd you hear? Apart from the music outside, what'd you hear? Uh-huh. Well, it's only me and you left. Frank is gone. Yeah. We're so virtuous in that front room area. Okay. <laughs> there's a little cat ball in here with the rattlesnake. Yeah, I kind of figured that, uh, you know, if they wanted to play with the toys, that that would be probably the area that they would go towards. Does this remind you of anything? Last night. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> what happened last night? Because I wasn't around. <laughs> okay. I was thinking, you know, New Mexico again. But... No, I know, I know. I'm just teasing. <laughs> Was that a sword? Never mind, this would be my weapon of choice, not the bat. <laughs> so, uh, rumor has it somebody named Frank, um, you know, is around, which is interesting because that's not me, is it? That's as soon as we me. mentioned as Frank. As soon as I said Frank. Dude, that wasn't me because I. Okay, that one was me, but when I did it the first time, it didn't even do anything. See? Mm -hmm. I'm literally like, Frank. As you can see, it's clearly not doing anything, but I don't know what that was all about. Frank, is that you? That was pretty cool. Yeah. That was awesome. That was my phone. Mm, okay, thought you had the bubbles. The what? The bubbles. Stomach bubbles. Mm, yeah. A little doggy. Frank, can you do that again for us? Frank, if you're here in this room right now with us, could you make that go off? Make it go to green. I'll buy you McDonald's. If you know what that is. I'll touch it for McDonald's. Huh? I said I'll touch it for McDonald's. I don't, I don't need you to touch it. We need Frank to touch it. Fair. Come on, Frank. Maybe I'll, I don't know. What, what did they used to eat back in the day that would have been like, you know? Caviar. Caviar? What? Huh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know about that one, but <laughs> maybe a sandwich or some roast beef. What do you like to eat, Frank? Want to use the uh, spear box? Turn it on, pal. Oh yeah, baby. I was looking at some of these photos here. Do you need a favor, Jazz? No. no. I can't get him so. <laughs> Pull up my antenna. Oh, God. Oh, baby. Thank you. You know, this is like a weird paranormal investigation that has gone sexual at this point. <laughs> I'm gonna put that in the title Haunted <laughs> Mansion Gone Roof <laughs> Sexual. Okay. It's both of us, uh, a little noisy. Alright. Frank, you here with us?
<laughs> I'm over here fist bumping to the. Hey Frank, why don't you come uh, come dance with your friend over here, or any of the children that might be here, actually, for that matter. That's right. If I act like a child, maybe I'll bring the children. Maybe, up. yeah, maybe we'll face them to come join the party. I'm gonna teach them how to floss. <laughs> <laughs> it is now 2022, and we have interesting dance moves. Yeah, we don't do the waltz anymore. Yeah, for example, we do. We now do the floss. It's a lot more fun. Would you like to come floss with us? I can't much at all. No, nothing at all. I don't even know if anyone's in here with us right now. Yeah. Is there anyone at all in here with us? Even if it's not Frank? That sounded like something. Yeah. Okay. Could you repeat that a little bit more clear? You show real exception. You show real exception. It's not like a Metro Mattress commercial. Yeah. I'm gonna go down the hallway see if I get some. Wow, look at this. Baby carriage. Did I just say don't leave? Uh, yeah. It sure sounds like it. I guess so. Just touch it. And maybe this thing with the red light. Sweet. So touch something. Oh, that's weird. Well, my camera's literally focusing on something on the wall. It was like, it was weird because it was, you were there. And yeah. then all of a sudden there was like something that it started focusing on the wall. That was right next to you. Hmm. Is anybody on this floor with us? Is there anyone on the third floor here with us? <laughs> that definitely sounds like a kid. Well, if you try the uh, instead. Yeah, let's give that a shot. Let me pull it out. Right. I'm gonna put my camera in here. Okay, that's not me though. That of course, was not me. The second we turn off the spear <laughs> box, we get some action. All right, we're gonna fire up Necrophonic. We're gonna give this a shot. Um, we were hearing some stuff through the SB7. That's SB7, right? Yeah. Yeah, but it wasn't like... It wasn't super clear. Yeah, so for me, this is going on my vlog channel at the moment, and I just want to like... It goes to show, like, a lot of the stuff that you see on, like, the main channel videos, although the videos may be, like, 30 minutes to an hour long, it's hours and hours and hours worth of, like, oh, investigating, yeah. you know? Yeah, not only that, but driving, too. Oh, man. All right, here we go, Necrophonic. Let's introduce ourselves. Hello, spirits. Take a bow. My name is Jazz, Yasko, however you want to call me. I'm joined with my buddy Antelope. Antelope? <laughs> Antelope? <laughs> and, um, yeah, let's go ahead. I don't know if that was like the movement of putting the phone down. Let's try it again. I just put my phone down. Didn't do anything? Dude, that one did it. That was a little, that was much harder. That was a thump. Yeah. 
Say jazz. Okay. I keep resetting it and it's not doing anything. That's the reset button? Yeah, that one. Huh. And it just said my name. Yeah, I heard that. That's cool. Hello! Awesome. Who, who's trying to contact us right now? It literally won't reset. What the heck is going on? Uh, did I maybe put something off when I put it on the bed? Should I take it off the bed? Maybe. I'll mm -hmm. take stuff back then. Okay. I feel like it doesn't like me. <laughs> it might not like you, yeah. You have any questions? Do you like that? Um, yeah. If there are any children with us, can you tell us your name? That was a good Something sounded like it was like choking, though. That was weird. Samantha. Cool. Sound like Samantha. Jazz again, bro. <laughs> oh, hello. Who is trying to contact me right now? What is your name? You know my name. How about some icebreaker questions? How old are you? Three? I heard three, yeah, I was gonna say that. Kinda sounds like a three. Well, it's, you know, children's room, I guess. It would make sense. Are you a boy or a girl? That one's at five? So we have a three year old and a five year old in the room right now. So we know there's a little girl here, but nobody can figure out who they are. Oh, yeah? Where they even came from. Wait, we did hear Samantha. That's true. Samantha, five years old, maybe. Um, Samantha, did you, you pass nearby? Oh yes, something, something. A little. How did you pass, Samantha? Was it, was it an accident? I have a question. your phone and I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about something Stop else. It, people. Hmm. Maybe, maybe the kids are trying to tell us upstairs. Mm -hmm. Samantha, are you trying to tell us something about upstairs? If you are, could you maybe make another noise from upstairs? I just said my name again, bro. Do you want me to go upstairs? I'll go alone if you want me to. Sure, sure. Here. Sounds like a trap. Yeah. Can Angelo come with me if I go upstairs? Or do you want me to go alone? Just you. <laughs> okay. Alright. Um, it's pretty creepy up there. We were getting some stuff earlier there as well. I went up there in the daytime. I'm yeah. not, I don't know if I'm ready for it. <laughs> Best of luck. I'm gonna go lights out. Just yeah. maybe it's just a thank you. You're welcome. I'll probably go to the uh, the servants area and then we'll uh, go upstairs afterwards. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, uh, Samantha, I would like to meet you upstairs if you could follow me up there, and then uh, maybe we could get to know each other a little better.
like someone like almost peeking out. Hmm. I know Marissa's there, but she's down on the stairs. <laughs> and she's, you would hear if she was moving. Yeah, you'd hear crazy. Yeah. Yeah. What I'm hearing is from upstairs. Up yeah, I don't know. There's a sweeper, but I don't... Yeah, but you didn't move it. It's right in the center. It shouldn't even be going that fast. Um, well, do you have any more questions? Here? Not really, no. Not at the moment, anyway. Do you want Angelo to go down into the basement alone and lock the doors and turn all the lights off? What is, what, what is like such a loaded question? <laughs> To go down the basement, lock the doors, and turn off all of the lights by himself. <laughs> hey man, put up the, you know what? Screw it. How about just no lights at all? And not even night vision. Just stand there in the complete darkness. <laughs> oh my god. No. Help. Help. Who needs help? Mama. Mama. What happened to Mama? Cool. What is Mama's name? What's up with those weird like breaths? It's very odd. Could you say it nice and clear for us? What was Mama's name? Good question. Yeah. We would like to know what the name of the mom was. Could you tell us? So you can help? We would like to help, but we need a little bit more information before. Are you trapped here? What happened to mom? Someone need help to get to the other side, maybe? Yes. Well, I'm gonna head upstairs. Maybe I hear some more information about this mom. Yeah. Or some man yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll just go lock myself in the basement with all the lights off, lights off. lock all the doors. Yeah, no and, lights, uh, yeah, yeah. Just stand there in the silence. <laughs> Pure darkness. <laughs> Wait, did you hear that? I got it. Marion. I heard Marion. And as soon as the name huh? Marion comes through, the that goes off. Can you do that again for us? Marion, was that you? You heard that, right? My camera is focusing on a person that's apparently on the bed. You see that, right? Oh my god, his camera is literally... Hold on. Like, it was... You were there, and it wasn't even focused. It's gone now, but... Oh, of course. Yeah. His camera had, like, the focusing lines. Like, right next to the... Like, the right of the bed. So it was interesting, because at first it, you were here, and it wasn't even noticing you. And then it was like, oh, there's someone here. And it's, like, moving all over the place. And it just... You moved out of the frame, and it was still there. Marion, is that you? Are you in the room with us right now? Is Marion the little girl? That likes to hang out in the billiard area? Who likes it when people go and lock themselves in there with no lights whatsoever? And... Stands there in silence by themselves. <laughs> I don't know what you're trying to implement here, Angelo. But <laughs> oh, man. Uh, well, I don't know. Now we just have to figure out if Marion was the mom or the daughter. Or maybe not even the daughter. Maybe they have no relationship. Maybe this is like yeah. just stemming from... Because this place is hundreds of years old. Who knows, man? It could maybe even be like maybe... From one of the families that lived here, maybe they lived here at some point and passed away, and somehow they became connected to the house. Plus, all the antiques could have brought something in too. That's You're right. They, that's what they think the deal is with the uh, 
with the uh, bed covers. I mean, bro, antiques that something could be attached to them easily. Yeah, uh -huh. like, that's why a lot of dolls are so haunted, you know, because a spirit's connected with it. Yeah. It resides with it. All right, Frank and whoever else resides here, feel free to uh, follow Jazz while he goes up into the third floor and locks himself in complete darkness. All right, I'm going to go well, say hi to the, uh, the servants if I can. I'm going to go get my night vision camera and I'm going to go up there alone. No lights. So see ya, Angela. <laughs> All right. Angela's going to be on the second floor right here. I'm going to make sure I close the door behind me. I'm so. scared. Huh? I'm scared. Me too. <laughs> but. I'm going here. To this room on the, uh, right here. Right here? Yep. That's the one. That's the servants' quarters. What makes you say that? Because it was literally... <laughs> I'll see you, man. All right, I'm gonna turn on night vision once I get up there. Ah, oh, here we go. Well, something or someone wants me to come up here and um, talk to them. This freaks me out. I'm not gonna lie to you. Kind of looks like a. Kind of looks like my high school counselor. No offense. He was a good man. I liked him a lot. All right. Ooh. All right. Let um, me fire up night vision. And then it's time to put the flashlight away. Okay, here we go. Flashlight, as you can see, is now off. Off, right? Yep, yeah, okay, cool. All I can see is what's through my screen right now. Anybody here with me right now? Samantha, Marion, anybody here? We're gonna have to really, really listen on this one because just because of everything that's going on outside, kind of frustrating, not gonna lie, but we're gonna work through it, okay? So. Here's a bit, oh my god, my chest. I, this always happens to me. I just get randomly get like really, really lightheaded and struggling to breathe. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put the camera down right here. Okay, sorry, I can't see anything. All right, I'm gonna put the camera down right here. It's on the pool table. It's fixated over here. I'm just gonna use my light right now just to be able to get over there. Sit down right here. We got some card games right here. I believe in you. Please do not touch. Okay. Spirits of this mansion, of this property. You wanted me to come up here. I'm here. Can we now talk? Can we communicate? If you could just give me some sort of sign that you're here with me, maybe do something like this, or maybe you would say something, by all means, go ahead. So, I'm gonna be honest, guys. For those who don't know, I'm going to be on television in a little bit. And I haven't done a paranormal investigation in a while, and I figured I'd do a couple before I go into the paranormal investigation for television, so I can really get back into the groove of things. And I'm taking it very easy right now, I'm taking it very slow, but damn, am I feeling the, the fear. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and fire a microphone up right now. Jazz, right away. Hello, I'm here. Are you here with me, Marion or Samantha? Now keep in mind guys, I can't see anything. You're you're my What did I just say? What did you just say? Can you repeat that one more time? Jazz. Yes. I'm here. Are you here? Where are 
are you in this room right now? End. The end of what? Are you on the other end of this table? Are you sitting down with me right now? Yes. Do you want to play maybe a card game or something? We have tic-tac-toe, I think. Cards, dice. Do you want to play any of these card games with me? We got making beans, tic-tac-toe. We can play poker. Do you want to play poker? Did you guys hear that from this room over here? Is anyone in this room behind me right here? <laughs> oh my god! That was a knock clear as day! Who's in that room? Two. Two people are in that room. What are your names? Can I come in there with you? Turn this light off. Let's go check this room out. You guys heard that? It was a knock clear as day. And I said, if there, is there anyone in there? I said two. So, all right. Keep in mind, I literally am just using nothing but my <laughs> camera screen to see. That's Angela. All right, hold on. Oh my god, I just missed a step. Okay. I'm just gonna use my flashlight for now. Okay. I heard a knocking coming from in here, almost like it was on the window or something. Who's in here? Can you make that same sound again? Yeah, see, there's people everywhere, bro. It's so hard to do anything here. Can you make that same sound one more time? There's no way. Is someone sitting in this chair right here? Oh my God. Okay. These sounds are clear as day. Whoa, 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 whoa. My screen was just so blurry, but I swear it was as if something just moved right across that door right there. Museum staff only, staff only. Can't even see inside really because the frosted glass. <sighs> 
This is really cool, actually. Pin the tail on the donkey. Do you maybe want to play billiards with me? Some eight ball pool? Oh my god, bro, there's sounds. It literally sounds like... Oh my god, what is that, bro? That's literally whistling. Who's doing that? Angelo, it's not you, is it? Literally sounds like it's in the same room with me right now. Angelo, it's not you, is it? We're about to find out if it is. Oh my god. That literally sounded like someone was whistling in this room. That's him right there. Angelo! You weren't just whistling, were you? No. Oh my guacamole. Bro, yes. I was asking if someone wanted to play billiards with me, eight ball pool. I'll and I'll play billiards with you. <laughs> and I just heard whistling. I was like, really? That was weird. Dude, I saw a woman in a white dress. What? Yeah. Well, I was standing in the uh, the room, yeah. in the servants' quarters. I had the door open, like, slightly. And as I kind of, like, looked outside, I swear to God, I saw this woman standing on, like, the second step. Just like looking at me. So weird. Was she your type? I don't know. I only caught a glimpse of her. <laughs> <laughs> well, clearly it wasn't love at first sight. So, can you take one off here? Yeah, bro. I, numerous times I asked for like, if anyone's here, can you make a sound or something? Mm -hmm. Numerous times I heard something like, and then I heard it coming from that room. Yeah. I was like, is anybody here? It said two on the spear box. Oh, really? I was like, okay. I go in there and right behind me, the same sound. Like, just like that. Huh. And when I was over here, it looked like, I'm gonna turn the lights on just for one second. It looked like there was something at this door that moved from left to right. And my camera was staring at the door and the whole screen just blurred. Really? Yeah. So they did say there was apparently uh, ghost hunters was here a while back, and they said there was a shadow figure. Somebody saw one somewhere in this general area, actually. Yeah, they caught a lot of activity here. That's why uh, Frank and I were investigating over here earlier because this place is supposed to be relatively active. Where we were getting a lot was there. Where? Um, that room? Yeah. That's like, that's where I was getting the activity. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah, we had the REM pod like living on the top step and it kept going off. Is there uh, somebody up there? Can you make a sound for us? That's what I was saying. It's hard to like tell what's... Yeah, it is what it is though. And Saturday night in a party area. Yeah. Yes, right from that room again. Yeah, Who's in there? I wonder if maybe if I go in there mm -hmm. alone and just stand right in the doorway, yeah. if we'll hear anything. Literally, I'll have both my hands on the camera. You stand right there. Let's see how this. Okay. Just please bear with me. I was trying to climb up this with no light earlier and I missed the step. <laughs> So I'll be standing like this. Angelo is right there. Angelo? My entire screen just got really blurry. Angelo, can you see if there's anything next to me or behind me from there? Like, first, zoom in, I don't see anything in 
Bro, my screen, I, I can't see anything. It's just like blurred right now. Hello? Bro. Hold on. What's going on? I can see you perfectly fine. But you can't see yourself? No. I can't see myself. Like, it's just completely blurry. I'm here. I'm, I'm real. That's weird. I can see you what the hell is going on? What is yours doing? In the room? Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I just felt, hold on, where does the stairs? I just felt like something just like gently touched my shoulder, like, like caressed me. Bro, it's just weird because my, sc my screen's perfectly fine now. Yeah. Look at my screen, perfectly fine. When I was in that room, bro, yeah. it was nothing. You couldn't see anything. Yeah. It was like darkness? No, no, it was just blurry. Really? Yeah. For some reason, like, when I was, like, zoomed in on you, it was like, for two seconds, it was, like, dimmed, and then it came back. There's something weird about that room. Yeah. That was so weird. It felt, it felt like something went like... Yeah. Oh, I like that. That's nice. Do it again? Shut up, man. <laughs> All right. Um, Maybe I'm gonna go in this room now. Yeah, please do. Holy cock, I'm Let's just try not to miss a step. 